misaligned compassion. Compassion may be there, but I may give compassion for the wrong cause. One of the stories my teacher used to say is that in his neighborhood, he saw one day that some parents were really irritated with one of their children. The circumstance was that the younger brother in the family had cholera, and the parents had told the older brother, don't give him any solid food because cholera patients can't take solid food. It can make them much worse. So when the parents had stepped out, he had snuck in a pastry and said, here, eat this. I want you to feel better because it's really good. And then the child became even more ill and practically died because of that. So the, the brother thought, oh, I'm doing him a favor. I snuck him in some pastry. And the parents then became extremely angry at him and said, we told you not to do it. And he said, well, I'm just trying to help. So if you don't know how to help, then be careful. Make sure that you're applying your compassion properly is one of the other teachings of the Srimad Bhagavatam. Make sure that you know what it is that actually helps somebody. And it's not necessarily helping the body, although that's important. It's not the most important aspect. And if you only attend to that, and if you do it in such a way that it harms others in the process, then you may have misplaced your compassion.